Assalamualaikum, hello everyone, welcome to my tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you how to export Houdini volume uh, to Cinema 4D using open VDB file and render it uh, using uh, Arnold Render in Cinema 4D. Let's get started. So, make sure you have Houdini in your machine. Uh, if you don't have Houdini, you can try Houdini Apprentice, which is the free version of Houdini. You can download here in the website let's get let's jump to Houdini so here we are in Houdini okay and uh, let's create uh, let's create a sphere just type in here and add sphere and the next step is we dive inside we want to we want to change this from primitive to polygon polygon and we're going to use mountain and just uh, link this node like so and we can increase the frequency let's increase the height maybe it's just like this okay the next step is Add null object, uh, null node, uh, all this out. Okay. Okay, the next step is uh, we want to emit smoke. So we we'll make it simple here. Call this emitter and go to pyro and just click bell the smoke. And uh, yeah, click it the smoke and when we hit play we should be able to see smoke rising inside this cube so very cool and uh, the next step is we want to convert this uh, smoke to open VDB so here we are in the dynamic network so let's go to scene level just click this OBJ Click it, and so now we in the scene level, and let's dive to our import here, and uh, delete this uh, import para visualization. We don't need that. So let's add. Uh, you know, you can increase the quality in the drop level here in the pyro. So this is the. This is <coughs> the quality of the smoke. You can increase that later, later, but I'm happy with this result right now in this case. So go to power import and let's add. Well, let's resume this. I think that's enough. Smoke rising up, and let's add convert VDB. Convert VDB. Let's link this node to op convert VDB and convert to VDB group. We want to add channel to this VDB file, so we want to add density. If you have a fire, for example, another channel, you can add fuel, heat, temperature, and so forth. So I'm going to use density. So the next step is we want to display this convert VDB. Click this uh, button right here, this eye icon, and uh, let's add file. Why? File, and uh, we want to write file and go to your directory. I'm just going to D and the uh, temporary tutorial and uh, I want to make smoke smoke a uh, tutorial that VDB if you want to export animation you can type uh, that dollar f3 for example uh, 
this will export a uh, animation so vdb sequence basically so i want to export only a still image a uh, still frame so i'm just going to leave it just like this okay the next step is if you know hit accept and just display render so now we have vdb let's go to cinema 4d and uh, let's create plugin cinema 4d to all node and use all node volume and file path open so here we have a vdb file that we created it's very low res as you can see the size is very small open okay so as you can see it looks similar with this uh, in Houdini viewport so let's turn to Cinema 4D and let's uh, create a sky go to plugin Cinema 4D and add Arnold sky we want to use a texture sky ah here texture here I have a sky backlight and uh, we want to use maybe this one maybe it looks okay the next step is we want to render this so let's use uh, a plugin smartphone d file node and use a uh, IPI window and uh, here we are rendering so we can see now we have smoke in our scene so you know that's it it's very easy and uh, to control the volume in cinema 4d you can create a cinema 4d or not and use arnold surf uh, arnold volume and use standard volume and just drag and drop to the arnold volume and you can control like density for example you can increase that maybe you can change the scattering color like white okay i think that's cool you know this is because of very low resolution you can increase the resolution and uh, increase this honor volume oops on sky increase the intensity just a little bit make it brighter cool now that we have our uh volume it's very easy for the further information about uh, open bdb file you can check out my tutorial here if you found a mistake please forgive me because i'm not a native english so if you have a question just type in the comments below if i can i will answer your question so thanks for watching and we'll see you next time